Hey guys, our next writing topic is a biography. This is one of my favorites. We're gonna be doing a wax museum. Have you ever been to a wax museum before? Uh, they're a little creepy because they're wax figures of people and they look real. So you're gonna be picking a famous person. It could be from now, it could be from the past, and it's gonna be somebody that has done amazing things for the world. Your job is going to be researching their early life, their adulthood, their character traits, some quotes that they had. You're gonna be looking up pictures. You're gonna be looking up all kinds of things about the person that you choose. Then later, you're going to be doing a flip grid with your wax figure ready to go. So you now might be wondering, who should I pick? Well, I'm gonna give you a list later, but I'm gonna show you a couple options now. guys so now that you know what we are going to be doing it's your job to pick the historical famous person that you would like to be so hopefully you have thought really hard if you're thinking i still have no idea who i want to be go to your google classroom and click on the uh, go to the writing material section and click on list of historical figures. On this list, you are gonna see a ton of different options from George Washington Carver to um, Marie Curie to Ulysses S. Grant and Rosa Parks. So there's so many people you can choose from. So you can obviously choose from this list or you can pick somebody um, different as well. So once you have that name and you are ready to go, go down to today's date, Monday, October 12th, and you're gonna click on informational writing document. So you're gonna pull up this informational writing document and it's going to look quite boring, but your job is going to, to make it more fancy and erase famous person's name and you are going to write who you are choosing. So, of course, I'm doing Sir Isaac Newton, but you cannot do Sir Isaac Newton because that's who I'm doing. So I'm going to put Sir Isaac Newton. Hi. Oops, there we go. Susan Albright. Okay. Now, if you want to go ahead and be fancy, you can uh, format um, your slides and you can change the theme. Uh, you can make it, you might like this theme. You might like this theme. You might decide, hey, I want to use this beautiful purple theme, but I want to add a picture as well. So I might pull up a different tab and search Sir, oops, Sir Isaac. I could spell it right. Newton. And I'm gonna look at some images of the oh so handsome Sir Isaac Newton. Oh, and this one he looks glamorous. So I'm gonna copy and paste. Oops, over to my informational writing piece. Oh, and it's beautiful. Look at that first slide. And that's all you have to do for today. So you'll, all you have to do is click turn in so your teacher can see it. Good luck and have fun.